Hey everybody, how you doing? We're dealing with some serious wood here. I'm probably going to rate this video not appropriate for children. Anyway, uh, the bedroom ceiling is going up. And as I pan upward, you'll see I'm approximately halfway through this first bay. I've had to trim around the can lights. I've also had to realign the can lights as I went because they were about three quarters of an inch off from one end to the other. Now I'm sure that's because the house is three quarters of an inch off from one end to the other. But for the sake of making the ceiling look nice, I went ahead and aligned the cans to the edge of the boards. This is the lap board pine that you get from Home Depot. I am not overly impressed. I mean, it's not that expensive. It's $7.50 US for a 12 foot piece. But the quality is terrible, to say the least. There's a lot of them. I don't know if this will show on camera or not. Maybe, oh, maybe it will from this angle. A lot of the boards aren't even milled, cut to the same thickness. They weren't milled to the same thickness. So there's variations in the level here. Um, I've had a lot of them that had the smiley bow in it, which is why you're seeing gaps that are not regular as well. And as you can hear by the radio in the background I'm gonna pan down to my feet we got thunderstorms again this time the storms are about 15 about 50 miles away excuse me and they are heading this way we're supposed to have a lot of rain and thunderstorms tomorrow so I'll be doing more videos uh, both radio and probably just some weather I'll shoot outside if the weather gets exciting. Anyway, but that's it for now. This is going to be a short video. I just wanted to show you some progress on the house. Once again, nice little bedroom ceiling here. You see my workbench is a huge mess. That radio chassis you see sitting on the bench is the newest acquisition, actually. Let's give that a brief shout out before I sign off. It is a Philco model 48. Let's see if I can get it. There you go, 48 482. Got this at the uh, thrift store for 30 bucks. Um, the speaker is in horrible, horrible shape. It's gonna need to be, I'm gonna do some temporary repairs so I can just test the radio and get it working and then I'll see about getting that reconed. But for now, I'm just gonna do some temporary fixes. By the way, it's an old electrodynamic speaker. It has a powered voice coil, not a permanent magnet. So kind of cool. Anyway, I'm gonna be working on that in the future, uh, the distant future. There's a lot of projects going on with the house. Um, as I've mentioned in previous videos, we have, you know, some lunatics here in town and a situation that's a little bit out of hand. This, all this work is actually more or less in preparation to sell this place if I need to. I just wanted to get at least the bedroom done. So that way, if I do have to sell, it'll be, you know, I'll have a decent bedroom so it'll help get more money for it. Anyway, but that's it for now. So we'll uh, do some more videos later. Um... I haven't forgotten about the uh, night tuning on the Pioneer. I'm sure everyone's here. That, that may be a good thing for tomorrow night. Uh, or maybe even later tonight because of the uh, thunderstorms in the area. But we'll see. Anyway, that's it for now. Uh, we'll see you on the next video.